Thanks for joining us. I'm Lee Martin with the WBZ News Update. Let's take a look at our top stories. Karen Reed's attorneys are heading back to court today. They claim the prosecution in this case has yet to turn over all the evidence. Reed is accused of hitting and killing her boyfriend with a car. Boston police officer John O'Keefe was found in a pile of snow outside a Canton home last year. The defense plans to ask the judge to give them access to the cell phone of the Boston police officer who owns that home where O'Keefe's body was found. T officials say corrosion is to blame for a box crashing down on a commuter at the Harvard Square station. Video shows that scary moment when a 200 pound box fell from a column hitting a rider. The boxes were part of a pilot program run by MIT to detect biological agents, but they have not served a purpose since that program ended a decade ago. Officials ordered crews to remove the rest of them. A man accused of leaving explosives on Harvard's campus says he was responding to a Craigslist ad. The FBI says William Giordani was caught on camera two weeks ago, setting down a bag filled with fireworks, wire and metal boxes. About an hour later, someone called Harvard University police from a New Jersey number saying three bombs had been placed on campus and they demanded money. Giordani says he was answering a Craigslist ad from a man who needed items delivered for his son. The FBI says he later admitted to knowing about the bomb threat. The person who posted on Craigslist still has not been identified, though. Let's get a check of your next weather forecast with meteorologist Jacob Wyckoff. Hey, Jacob. And we do have a cool start out there with temperatures in the 40s and 50s, but we will see the clouds continuing to thicken. And if it's not raining where you are right now, it likely will be by the time we get into the midday. You see the stair step up into the middle 50s for our afternoon temperatures. Then the showers really start to blossom. So we'll thicken the clouds. Then the showers arrive and we hold on to some of those shower chances right on into dinner time and beyond into Thursday. Cool day on Thursday, upper 40s for highs. We'll likely be in the 50s by the time the when all is said and done for the day, but during our daylight hours, upper 40s. Saturday and Sunday, 60s and 70s. Fantastic weekend ahead. Liam? All right, Jacob, thank you. I'm Liam Martin. This has been a WBZ News Update. Have a great day, everybody.